Hello, it is day 129. My folks drove us back to the trail today and I am now back at Crater Lake and it is just as beautiful as ever. It's a different time of day, so things look a little different, but uh, it's a, a, a clear sunny day, but it's been getting cold. I think it's probably supposed to get below freezing tonight. And uh, so that'll be a new adventure. Uh, I really want to say thank you to Molly and Gordy and Uncle Bob and Aunt Tammy and my parents for helping out uh, a bunch of hikers and feeding us. It's really, really generous of all of you. So thank you so much for, for being a part of this adventure in such a generous way. And Mom and Dad, you were just so wonderful to me and to Britt. In, uh, in the time that we shared here in Oregon. So thank you, and I wish you safe travels. Uh, so what I'm doing right now is walking along what's called the Rim Trail, a trail that goes along the rim of Crater Lake. And it recently reopened just a couple days ago, uh, having been closed because of a wildfire in the area. So something interesting about this trail is that it's not technically the PCT. Um, it's known as the hiker PCT, and the equestrian PCT, which is the real PCT, actually stays quite a bit lower and does not go around the rim. Uh, this is one of the cleanest bodies of water on our entire planet, and I'm guessing they didn't want the horses pooping on it or near it. That's my guess. But, uh... uh even as recently as last year, there were PCT signs on the rim trail, but they've since taken them down. And so this is technically an alternate. And this is the first alternate trail I've done. And, uh, but I feel good about it because uh, I'm still connecting my footsteps and it's freaking beautiful. I mean, if you were on the equestrian PCT, you wouldn't even have any views of the lake. And this is one of the most beautiful places on the entire trip. So I feel thankful that it's opened up and I get to walk along it. And uh, yeah, it's interesting. The, in the past few days, it has seemed to gone from summer to fall. And uh, I don't know, it just kind of offers a different perspective and uh, this trip and in, in the having started in the spring and gone through the heat of the summer and now it's cold again. So I feel really blessed to still be on the trail and uh, excited to see what's next. we got a lot of beautiful things coming up. So thank you so much for joining me on this journey. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.